Hi guys, welcome to my channel. So today I'm gonna to be talking to you guys about my weight loss journey and how I lost two dress sizes and six inches off my waist. I posted a photo on Instagram of my weight loss journey and I started getting lots of questions on how I did it and um, what diet I was following and I thought okay I'll make a video because um, this seems to be a really hot topic so I'll make a video about it and share with you guys how I did it. Um, basically there's no real secret what I did was insanity. Um, if for those who don't know, well everybody's heard of Insanity, but for those who don't know, Insanity is about an eight week program created by Sean T. Um, it's a cardio program and it also has a nutrition side as well. So Insanity has two phases. Uh, phase one is around about 35 to 45 minute exercises. And phase two, the exercises get longer. It's about an hour to an hour and a half. So that's what I did. I can't say it was easy, you guys. It was really difficult to get up in the morning and decide, okay, I really want to do this. But I found for the best time for me to work out is as soon as I wake up, just go ahead and do it. Don't think about it. Don't even consider, oh, I'll do it later. Because once you start your day, there's no way you're going to actually get back to doing the exercise and you just think oh I'll do it later and later never comes so as soon as I woke up I would do insanity and then I could carry on with my day um, in terms of nutrition nutrition is absolutely crucial to weight loss um, I didn't stick to the nutrition program in insanity because I found it a little bit too rigid for my needs and um, I'm a type of person I like variety in my foods I can't eat the same thing every day for two or three months it just it just wouldn't work for me so what I did was something called the 40 40 20 diet uh, which is not really a diet in itself it's 40% protein 40% carbs and 20% fat I rather that than actually sticking to um, a rigid diet and buying foods that I might not be able to find in the supermarket because they're simply not in season. Um, so yeah, that made it a lot easier for me to control what I eat. And also I found that I eat, I had to eat a lot of food to get through the workouts. If I didn't, I'd feel really dizzy and tired and, you know, just didn't feel like I had energy to go on with my day. Um, so I was eating about... I think maybe 2,000 calories a day, um, which is quite a lot of food when it's good food. I didn't have any trackers or heart rate monitors or anything like that when I first did Insanity. Now I have a Fitbit, um, but what I used to use was the Fitness Pal. Um, it's an app that you guys can download from the App Store or you know just use on your computer. Then I used the Insanity Equation to work out how many calories I'd be burning that day doing the Insanity program. And then I subtracted 500 calories from that to make sure that I would be in a deficit. So anything that I would eat would equal to 500 calories less than what I was burning. That made sure that I lost um, 3,500 calories a week, which is equal to a pound. So a typical day on the Insanity program for me would be I'd wake up in the morning, I'd have lemon tea so that would literally be um, a cup of hot water and lemon and then I'd go do insanity after insanity I'd have breakfast breakfast consisted of um, oatmeal with honey and half an apple um, probably some blueberries and and maybe half a banana if I'm feeling really hungry at that time a mid-morning snack would probably be um, a yogurt and some almonds and maybe some strawberries as well if I'm you know, if I'm in the mood for them. Um, and then I'd have lunch. And lunch would probably be something like a salad, maybe. Um, croutons and um, chicken breast. I'd make sure that every single meal I had would be high protein. So yeah, then I'd have dinner. And dinner for me would be my, my most protein rich meal. Um, I'd probably have something like a steak, I love steak, or um, grilled chicken or some fish maybe um it really depends on um you know what i had for the rest of the day earlier in the day so as i said i do the 40 40 20 diet so if i figured that i've had too much fat or too many carbs um then i would try to make my last meal um balance that out to make sure that i get that 40 40 20 um balance and um 
so yeah if I've had too many carbs of the day then I'd have something less carby like uh, instead of having brown rice with my fish or my chicken I'd have asparagus or broccoli or you know something that would be a little bit lighter um, and that's it that's what I'd eat for the day but if I was still a bit hungry maybe a little bit peckish at night uh, I would have something very light and still rich in protein um, so maybe I'd have um, another yogurt or um, if I haven't had enough fat for the day or you know my, I, I haven't had enough calories for the day I'd have a scoop of peanut butter which I absolutely love um, I'm really a fat girl inside so I have to try hard to control that everybody has that fat in a child that loves to eat cake and that's me so I did do insanity again last summer and I didn't follow the program to T this time. I sort of switched it up a bit. I went to the gym some days and did weights. And for cardio, I did Insanity. So let's say on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, I'd do Insanity. And the rest of the time, I'd go to the gym. Or the next week, I'd do it, you know, more Insanity and less gym. It really depended on how I felt at that time. I wanted to make it more of a lifestyle choice. So I wanted to make it something that I could do all the time and um, maintain because that's a big part of weight loss is consistency I like working out but sometimes when it's really intense you just don't feel like it and um, I didn't want to beat myself up about it because that's you know that's the type of person that I am I'm a perfectionist I would like things to be exactly right and if it's not perfect then I completely lose my shit <laughs> and um, I have to you know I just have to make sure that it's right I got really good results, um, but winter came, it was cold, and um, yeah, I ate cookies and hot chocolate, and I fell off the wagon a little bit. So I'm going to do Insanity again, and I'm going to also be going to the gym as well. Um, because I found like that really works for me, and I like the variety, I like the mix-up. We're in March now, so we have approximately two and a half months. Um, before summer gets here and before I go off on my holiday and um, I'd like you guys to join me if you would like to lose weight and we can help each other out it'd be really great to hear about your experiences and um, you guys can post your comments um, and we can have a discussion on it you guys can let me know what you think how you guys have been doing with your uh, weight loss I'll be uploading progress videos every Sunday and telling you guys you know about what I ate, how the week went, did I actually work out and you guys will see bi-weekly videos of my results so you'll definitely be holding me accountable um, I won't be skipping any days because I know you guys will be watching so yeah subscribe to my channel if you guys want to do this with me and check in with me every Sunday to let me know how your journey is going if you like this video please like, share and comment below Thanks guys, till next time, bye.